Hi guys, it's Kristen here. Sorry, trying to get comfortable. Um, today is day 21 of my weight loss journey, and they say that if you can stick to something for 21 days, you have created a new habit, and you can also kick in a habit, an old habit, bad habit, whatever, in 21 days. So, I think I'm over the first hump, which is exciting because I have noticed I do drink this an awful lot. Water, by the way. That's what's in my cute little alcohol. Um, I reach for water before I reach for anything else. And I try to, I don't have any tea. Like, I haven't had tea for a while. Um, even though my husband makes it with a cup of Splenda and a half a cup of sugar, I still don't, I don't want that sugar. Um, even though I have sugar in my diet, I haven't, like, you know, stopped, excuse me, sugar altogether. But I'm definitely watching it more carefully. Um, so anyway, so I have drank 111.7 ounces of water which is still great. Um, I definitely feel better with water in my system. For breakfast, I had two egg whites, scrambled. That was it, and I enjoyed it thoroughly. Uh, and for lunch, I had a whole wheat, two a whole wheat. I had two slices of whole wheat bread, two ounces of honey turkey, a pickle, two, uh, or, why do I have two tablespoons? Excuse me, apparently I don't know how to grate anything down. It's one tablespoon of mayo, thank you very much. And um, the Special K brownie bites, but I didn't eat all of them because they fell on the floor. So, But I still counted them. Four, and I also had 12 ounces of Diet Cherry Pepsi, which actually lasted me all afternoon. So I actually ate, or ate it, drank the rest of it for dinner. Um, so I had three pop ices at around 2 o'clock as a snack. And then before dinner, because I was starting to get rumbly in the tumbly and I didn't want to overeat for dinner, so I thought I would have something somewhat nutritious. So I had, um, Del Monte's sugar-free dry, or, um, dried, mm -hmm. diced pears, a cup of them, and they were delicious. And then for dinner, I had one chicken dog, a quarter cup of French fries, one cup of broccoli, a tablespoon of margarine, a quarter cup of mushrooms and onions sauteed, and two burgers. Now, the brand that I have, I can't remember the name of it, and I forgot to bring the box up here. Um, they are, they, they call them Turkey burgers, T U T U. Key, so it's two key burgers. Anyway, um, there's something on my computer. Get off there. So I had those, and they're actually made from mushrooms. Hey, Papa Greg, you're gonna love them. Um, but they're really good, and they're not bad for you for two burgers. And they're they're. I mean, they're not like gigantic. They're uh, um, yeah, they're like that size. Um, the, it's 180 calories, 20 grams of protein. Ugh, I'm like invest, infested by bugs. Ugh. Um, eight grams of fat, no sugar, 400 milligrams of sodium, no fiber and 12 carbs. So it's really not all that bad. So that is what I had. I had no morning snack, no evening snack. Um, so I had 1,021 calories, which is way under by 949 calories of what I was supposed to have. Um, I had 54 grams of protein, 45 grams of fat, under by 21. Um, my sugars were 38, which I, I, I know it's under. I just don't know by how much because I didn't write it down. My sodium, again, was over by 96 milligrams, which isn't that bad. My fiber was under, and my carbs are under, and yeah. So for my Fitbit, I did 5,008 steps. I went 2.39 miles, burned 2,156 calories and did 72 floors. Um, I, I think I said this on last night's vlog. I'm trying not to do the walking every day. Like I'm trying to do smaller distances. So I walked down to pick my son up off the bus and back. And then I did the same thing for my daughter and came back. And then this evening, everybody else was walking. So it motivated me to just go out for an extra walk. And I did like three quarters of a mile. So I'm still hitting my 5,000 goal. Um, I haven't changed it yet. I'm going to, but slowly. Um, so yeah, I'm still feeling really good. Unfortunately, uh, we ran into a little snafu of financial situation. My husband was getting paid bi-weekly, and now at this new job, he is getting paid weekly. And when for two and a half, three years, you're used to the same, you know, you know how much is coming in every two weeks, and you know what has to go out every two weeks, when you have to cut that in half, it throws you for, at least for me, it threw, threw me for a loop. 
So I was like, oh yeah, that's, that's, oh, that'll come out on the next page. Or that'll, and, and it's like, wait, no, it can't. Oh, oh, oh. And yeah, so we got ourselves into a little snafu. So the doTERRA Vitality Pack will not be ordered until next week, which stinks, but I'm only taking one a day right now, just so I still have it in my system. Um, it still makes me feel, you know, pretty good, but I've noticed that I'm not the happy person that I was when I first started them. And up until last week when I had to slow down on them. And it's sad that they really do regulate you so much, and it, I miss them. So I'll definitely have to uh, purchase them next week when I can. So thanks for watching. I will be back tomorrow for day 22. And, uh, yeah, I hope you guys are still doing really good. And, you know, motivation is the key. I am lucky to have a lot of friends and family surrounding me on Facebook and in just everyday life that remind me um, to get moving. And, you know, even if it's raining outside, get on the fit, you know, the Wii Fit. Um, if you don't do that, clean, you know, just do what you, what you can do to just move your body every day. It's so important. And the other thing is, I can't say it enough, the water. The water is such an amazing thing. It, it detoxifies you, gets all those free radicals out of your system. So even if you can't eat 100% organic or raw or whatever, you are still flushing those nasties out. So... Drink cold water. So I'll talk to you guys later. Bye.